Happy Valentine's Day! So I just woke up and Max surprised me with a brand new tripod which you cannot see because I'm using it and I love it and it's the Gorilla tripod. Um, cause I guess I bought an off brand one and I bought a really small one before and it definitely broke apart into pieces. <laughs> so, and he got me these really good smelling bloomin' <laughs> and some chocolate, 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 <laughs> chocolate, and yeah, so happy Valentine's Day. Happy Valentine's Day. Day. I am leaving tomorrow morning. I'm going back to Texas for three months and I will be figuring out my visa process for coming back and everything like that while I'm in the US and travel a little bit around the US and see my friends and family because I haven't been home for a very long time. The audio has probably just changed very dramatically from from being in there to being out here. Um, huh? I'm tired of hearing those voices. <laughs> That's literally what we wake up to. It's just that man screaming. I don't know what he's screaming, but. We're gonna go to our favorite coffee shop right now. And eat a croissant. And drink Cafe a alone. cappuccino. Cappuccino. <laughs> <laughs> How do you feel about me leaving tomorrow? It really sucks. I'm not excited about it, but it's gonna be okay. Everything's gonna be okay. Are you gonna cry right now? I'm gonna cry. Cry. <laughs> cry. <laughs> cry. <laughs> So it's tradition where I have to eat Max's food first. Because <laughs> I usually make the better choice. All right, guys, so we just went to my favorite coffee shop and it was kind of sad because she was like, maybe I'll see you in three months. And I was like, no, like you will. And she's like, well, I meant like if we're still around. And I was like, I love this coffee shop. So that was kind of <laughs> yeah. sad. Name's Ketori Coffee. Definitely and recommend. And a side street to the Panishtas. I'm not exactly sure where, but we'll blend in the name here. Yeah, definitely recommend it. And now we're going to the mall because I have a receipt and we have to show an exchange form. Or no, we have to get an exchange form because I can get taxes back on the camera that we just bought, like $200. Yeah, that's a lot of, of money. taxes. <laughs> so. Alright guys, so just like always, we ended up not walking out of Media Mart just to just do what we needed to do. <laughs> we walked out with a scale and with a Chromecast. a Chromecast because we have a TV. We brought Max's TV from his parents' house to our apartment here in Berlin, but we don't watch cable TV, so... Yeah, we're just gonna use the Chromecast to watch YouTube and Netflix and stuff like that. Exactly, sorry Max, you're not in this frame, but my arm really can't. Now we're gonna go return something at Pull and Bear because I bought this shirt, really cute, I was really excited about it, didn't try it on, and the head, the head part where you stick the, 
I don't know. What yeah, do you call it? Yeah, the, yeah. the hole in the shirt at the top where you put your head through it. Well, it's too small for my big head, so I have to return it. Okay, so we decided instead of taking public transportation that we're just gonna drive there because it takes 45 minutes on public transportation and takes like 22 minutes. Then after that, we are going to go pick something up from eBay Classifieds because Max is getting really into flipping things, like just getting things for free on eBay Classifieds and flipping it. He went from broke to not so broke in a few days doing some flipping um so yeah we're gonna do that afterwards this is probably not a very typical day before you leave uh, type people of be video out and already yeah and no like that, but that's not us uh, it is me <laughs> that's that's my personality type i freak out about packing but I guess this is just different for me because I know I'm going to be back in three months and now I have a place of my own so I can just leave things there. So my plan is I'm going to set a one hour long timer and I'm just going to pack whatever for one hour and whatever doesn't make it doesn't make it. In one hour? Like if a camera doesn't make it in that one if hour? If it doesn't make it, it doesn't make it. We still need to buy chocolates and stuff like that? Yeah, I still need to get chocolates. And that's about it. And then we're gonna go eat pizza. Well, I'm gonna eat pizza. I don't know what you're eating. I don't know yet. Pizza, I'm eating pizza. I'm so excited. I'm really gonna miss European pizza. You can get really good, good pizza in Houston, but it's still not the same. And then still not the, the restaurant same. is most likely owned by an Italian. Yeah. Like, from my experience, if the restaurant is not owned by that nationality, it's not authentic. No. Not good. It's like all of these Mexican places around here are not actually run by Mexican people. So they're not good. It's horrible <laughs> food. But, yeah. So, alright, that's about it. That's See our all. expertise on restaurants. <laughs> I want to buy this sweater, but I know it's going to be hot when I get to Texas. But it's really cute and I want it. So I'm trying to look at the weather, but my internet's not working. So maybe we can look at your weather app. Maybe I can look it up. Or maybe we're just going to guess that it's so little cold and you just buy the sweater. Is it the port? Texas. Oh, look, it's cold. <laughs> okay, this is something I'm really high key gonna miss. Bratwurst mm. im Brotchen. Mmm. Mmm. Lekker, 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 lekker. Zeer lekker schmecker. Lekker schmecker. <laughs> lekker, lekker, lekker. Do you like bratwurst <coughs> in Brotchen? Comment down below. Everybody's like, no, I if hate it. If the answer it. is no, I don't like you. <laughs> All right, guys. So I didn't really realize that I wasn't recording, which is my bad. But I am currently packing and... It's chaos because I basically live here now, so um, I have a lot of stuff here, but I'm not taking any toiletries. I'm not taking heavy winter outfits because I'm going to Houston, Texas, and it's really warm weather there. So I just set a goal of like one hour to pack. If something doesn't make it, then that's that. It didn't need to make it. So I'm basically almost done. Um, yeah, it doesn't really, like, there's really not that much that I'm packing. Um, I'm guessing it probably weighs around 20 pounds right now. I don't have a lot. It will, probably looks like a lot because I have it folded up not that nicely. I'm not rolling anything because I just don't have that many things. Um... But yeah, I just want to get it done with. So, 
see y'all after I'm done. <clears throat> y'all, it's a Christmas miracle. I finished packing in 30 minutes. That is definitely a record for me. Usually it takes me hours to pack. And uh, Max is getting hungry, so now we're gonna head on over to our favorite Italian restaurant. Max is being a good dog dad and feeding his dog. Yeah. I hope he doesn't choke on his dry food this time. So I put some water in. Soften it up. Let's wait a couple of minutes. There we go. Cheers. Happy Valentine's Day. Happy Valentine's Day. And I were talking and I'm really not hungry and we're talking about how it's a shame that I'm not hungry and now I'm regretting eating the bratwurst. I'm hungry guys. <laughs> Wowza. 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 Good appetit. Happy Valentine's Day. Happy Valentine's Day. <laughs> It's cold, it's cold, it's cold, it's cold, it's cold. Okay, we're it's heading cold. back to the apartment. We're done eating. Now we're just gonna chillax a little bit. Yes, I have a blue belly. <sighs> I'm so full. I'm pretty full too. And yeah. Talk about how devastated you are. I'm very devastated. Why? I don't know. You're trying to get me to cry. Yeah. Cry on camera, come on, it's the content we need. <laughs> Thank you.